The USDA wants to make your chicken much safer. Madeline Rivera has more from Washington. Salmonella makes more than a million Americans sick every year, and now the feds are making a big push to bring that number down. The Agriculture Department announcing new proposed rules on Monday aimed at limiting salmonella in chicken and turkey, hoping to keep contaminated meat off store shelves. We're going to be monitoring that. We're going to be monitoring that the process in the plant is under control. The USDA is taking a two-pronged approach, proposing poultry companies keep salmonella levels under a certain threshold and also establish monitors to identify contamination throughout the slaughter and processing system. But with grocery stores still being hit hard by inflation, there are some concerns any new regulation could push prices even higher. It is infuriating to go to the store week after week and see that a pound of chicken breasts that cost $5 last week was marked up to $6 this week. The USDA says it will work with poultry companies to help mitigate the cost of the monitoring, but also say it's a small price to pay to protect against a deadly bacteria that causes more than 400 deaths every year. There will be a lot less possibility for me to get sick through consumption of poultry products. Because now there is a system whereby if there is a potential for me to be exposed, that product should not be in commerce. The CDC says about 1.3 million Americans get sick from salmonella each year, and about 170,000 of those are because of contaminated poultry. In Washington, Madler Rivera, Fox News.